Yeah, when I blow up, I'ma soar high like Peter Pan. In real life, be living out my dreams. If I'm waking up, it's in a foreign land. Welcome back again to another day. We are gonna be going to the gym. It's a little bit different. We're going at nighttime. So it's currently 10 o'clock at night. I never train at that time. It's always in the morning. We have today's session and then two more after that. And then it's competition day on the 20th of July. All right, we are in the mix with Jared as he warms up for his squat session here. again eating a cookie this morning gonna have this and a protein shake so I'm gonna try and keep my carbs kind of low but not too low uh, the main thing is I'm trying to get my calories in but also try and keep the food weight as low as possible so that's why I'm eating the cookie this morning whenever I do a water cut I'm always super cold so this is the fit of the day look like a total scrub you want my mind a lot don't need no time, watch. I don't know how I got you in my parking spot. Yeah, this bay, miss you every day. You like my oxygen. Make it seem like the barge in them. Got my heart, no barge in them. From the to the floor, to the couch. Might wait, the neighbors up. But you ain't been breaking you out. In the end, we gon' make it chat. Then we gon' hit the show. Part two, we don't need no pause. We miss you, we gon' get tipsy. You need a power shot. Copy my steel. Face the fact that ain't no cap, I'm real. Ain't no cap, I'm real. Plastic bars when I copy my steel. Copy my steel. Face the fact that ain't no cap, I'm real. No cap, I'm real. Plastic bars when I copy my steel. Got my heart, no. Got my water. I'm drinking about 8 to 10 liters today. Foods that I'm going to be eating is going to be high calorie but low in weight. So also today we went to the gym. I didn't work out or do anything. I just watched Fiona work out. Today, tomorrow are rest days and then I compete. So I take two rest days before my meet and then I compete. So usually for most weight cuts that I do, I don't usually have carbs two days out. I usually cut out carbs, but since I am a pretty light body weight right now as I am, this is good. I think that I don't have to really do glycogen depletion or cut out carbs. Mm. <laughs> Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another morning. So this morning I was 164.4 pounds. So I only need to lose about a pound and a half, not even. So what I've been doing to my eggs is I've been putting some olive oil. I've also been adding in uh, some butter. Today I just want to make things easy and I'm just going to cut out the salt and then I'm just going to eat these eggs plain basically. I'll probably add a little bit of garlic powder into it. Okay, so we got breakfast. Got my coffee. So we got three eggs here. Coffee. Going to add some uh, protein powder. This is like, this is like my favorite one. Can get it from Costco. Tastes so good. So I'm gonna add this to my coffee. Now we got protein coffee. All right, guys. It is nighttime. We are officially less than one day out. We are just the night before competition. 
getting my concoction ready for when I, after I do my weigh-ins so that I can rehydrate and replenish everything that I did for my water cut. So whenever I compete, I always focus on rehydrating first before eating anything. So this is gonna be the first thing that I have right after weigh-ins. And I'm talking like right after weigh-ins, moment that I step out of that room after weigh-ins, I get right into rehydrating because we only have less than two hours to rehydrate. So we got water, we got coconut water. So I'm gonna take the coconut water and I'm gonna dump it into here. Next thing I'm gonna have is one teaspoon of salt. So this is one teaspoon. Oops, even if it's a little bit over, it's not a big deal. So one teaspoon. Next thing, I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add some honey. I'm gonna do like two to three squirts in here. One, two, it looks so funny when it goes down. Three. And we're gonna put some lime in there. So the lime, it's good for digestion, but and it's gonna help you absorb this concoction a lot better. And it's also gonna taste really good. So I'm gonna put an entire lime in here. So probably one whole lime. And a dash of tequila. I wish it was tequila. It smells so good. That's pretty much it for the concoction. So usually for me, like I'm so thirsty right now that I feel like this is gonna taste so good. Like every time I drink this, it tastes so damn good but maybe because I'm super dehydrated. Yeah, I'm gonna shake it up. If you guys need assistance with your water cut, just let me know. Shoot me a DM on Instagram, it's Jared James Fit, and I would love to help you out. I don't mind sending you guys a template that you guys can follow for your water cuts. You guys just need to reach out to me. But anyways, we'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna try and get some film. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to film yet or if someone is gonna be filming, so. That's my situation right now, and I'm not sure yet. So, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Jared McIntyre, 240 kilos. Jimmy Fulton, 195 kilos, deuxième essai. Jérémy Fontaine qui pousse de toutes ses forces pour réussir. Simon Rousseau qui voulait ce squat a tout donné, mais malheureusement on refuse la montre. Squat! Dash Pit Abdul le Gafo. 27.5 ask on the bar, Jared McIntyre on this side, second attempt is good, two, one minute remaining after, it's going to be too late, une minute de start pour les opener, si vous ne changez pas votre opener là, en fait vous restez une minute, changez votre opener, stop, go down, you got this,
La Baba Chauche for Gabriel Turner. Deux cent quinze kilos. Start. Start. All my dreams if I'm waking up it's in a foreign land whole wrist covered up in ice dealership never asked the price I hit the molly ball with my dogs y'all swipe it once without thinking twice cuz this what I was made for man I know this what I